Hi beauties, welcome back to our weekly vlog where our topic today is six natural allergy relief remedies. And now that it's spring, I thought this would be a really great topic. We get so many questions from our community about allergies, whether it's itchiness or sneeziness or running eyes. There's just so many different ways that allergies express themselves. And of course it's no fun and allergies can of course be kicked up in the springtime with the pollen and with just being outside more and more growing in general. So I thought we'd get into some really effective natural remedies, which are, is backed up by research, which we'll get into in just a moment. And these remedies, which we're talking about today are mostly in the food category. Food is our first cornerstone of Saluna, although some of them will also affect our emotional well-being and our energy all around because as always, we always want to look at a holistic approach to anything that we're talking about. So first remedy is foods with vitamin C. And vitamin C is one of those vitamins that is just so powerful and effective. It's almost, when I think of vitamin C and vitamin C rich foods like lemons and citrus, I almost think about the sun energy directly captured into that food and just providing that a wonderful healing vitamin C quality. And vitamin C is a highly potent antihistamine. Um, a study show, found that taking a thousand milligrams of vitamin C three to four times a day provided substantial relief for seasonal allergy sufferers. Now, because it's an amazing antihistamine, because it's in so many amazing Saluna Beauty Detox foods, I don't necessarily think you need to just take a supplement. I think if you drink your glowing green smoothie, if you add lemon juice to your salads, if you enjoy oranges and berries and dark leafy greens and salads, you're gonna get a lot of vitamin C. Of course, if you're worried, if you travel, you can take some sort of supplement, but either way, it's something that you definitely want to get in regularly, especially if you are an allergy sufferer. Next food is foods with quercetin. And I love saying that, quercetin. And there have been studies that show that daily a daily quercetin supplement, particularly combined with vitamin C, can help reduce allergy symptoms. Now, again, we can get quercetin from a lot of natural foods, including apples, green tea, garlic, and onions. Now, I'm not a huge onions and garlic person myself. Um, I find it a little bit aggravating, and I don't feel as great when I eat a lot of onions and garlic, but everybody's body's different. Otherwise, that whole saying, an apple a day is so good, it keeps the doctor away, may be related to how much quercetin there is in apples. Or again, you can supplement if you are really trying to get enough in to help with more severe allergy symptoms. Third is ginger, and ginger is very powerful. Um, it's great for nausea, it's great for circulation, it's great for detoxification, and guess what? It's great for allergies as well. A study published in the International Journal of Preventative Medicine found that ginger's antioxidant and anti-inflammatory properties ease the symptoms of from irritation. So I definitely, in this case, recommend that you take fresh ginger. You can slice it, you can add it to hot water and sip on it, which is my favorite way to consume ginger, or you can slice it up, put it in a stew or a stir fry, cook with it, make it part of your life. But the fresh ginger is really potent and really inexpensive. So I definitely recommend that. Next food that's amazing nat natural remedy for your allergies is bromelain, which is a type of enzyme found specifically in pineapple. Mmm, sounds yummy in our GGS. And guess what? Pineapple also has a ton of vitamin C. But research found that natural, a natural bromelain supplement around 200 to 800 milligrams a day was also very helpful in relieving uncomfortable allergy symptoms as it is an anti-inflammatory, so it helped to reduce swelling and increasing blood flow. So get your GGS, or get your pineapple, put it in your GGS. I'm actually a fan um, sometimes of getting frozen pineapple, which is usually frozen, flash frozen at the peak moment of ripeness. So you're getting a lot of vitamin C, then it tastes good, it's ripe. Sometimes I get pineapples from the store and they're just not that great. 
and then there's a lot of work cutting them up. So frozen pineapple, I just wanted to mention, is also a great option. Next remedy is probiotics. And we know that when we take care of our gut health and our microbiome, it helps to reduce inflammation. It helps to balance our bodies. It helps to boost our immunity and our immune um, capabilities in keeping all these little irritations uh, quelled. Studies have shown that a weak microbiome creates a poor immune system. So we can increase our probiotics by taking our SBO probiotics, which is the kind I take and recommend that you do every single day. Fermented foods are amazing, like raw sauerkraut, but they do not replace a good probiotic supplement, especially when it's this important. And finally, I wanna recommend turmeric as our sixth natural allergy relief remedy. One study published in the Molecular Nutrition and Food Research Journal showed that turmeric reduced the allergic response. So turmeric has an active ingredient called curcumin, which is also anti-inflammatory. You can see that anti-inflammatory foods are definitely a theme connected to allergies. uh, Turmeric cleans the blood. It adds a delicious earthy flavor. Try adding it into Also your soups and stews, even salad dressing. You can make a really interesting lemon turmeric salad dressing, which I've been doing recently. And it's a great idea to combine uh, turmeric with black pepper or something really pungent, which helps to increase its bioavailability. So if you are suffering from allergies, please try some of these remedies, some of these foods. Let me know how you do. Everybody's body reacts differently to different foods. If you know anybody who's suffering from allergies and they're loading up on all these prescriptions and medications, of course, that may be necessary and that may be helpful, but please forward them this video because some of these foods just right from their kitchen could provide them a lot of relief in a natural way without excessive side effects. So thank you so much, Beauty, for tuning in. Thank you so much for being part of our community. I will see you back here next week for another vlog. Till then, be sure to check out our Feel Good podcast and social, which is at underscore Kimberly Snyder. I will see you here soon and sending you so much love.